Bochrim, the Yeshiva. So how do they give Mishrach Monas? So each one swaps their portion with each other. The Yeshiva Bochrim isn't allowed to tell the person, I'm going to give you a Mishrach, I'm going to give them my portion, and you'll give me yours. Each Yeshiva Bochrim understands that you're giving each other each other's portion, and they swap their portions, and that's called Mishrach Monas. Even though the portion, a boy's portion, his shiva bochur's portion, it doesn't belong to him, it belongs to the shiva. Because now that he's eating it, he's allowed to, he's allowed to give his portion over to another bochur. Now, if in this portion that his shiva bochur has, and there's a few fruit of shmita fruit, shmita products, so even though the shiva bochur's are swapping with each other, they're giving you, and we said according to all the opinions, one's not allowed to give return Mishrach Monas that Shmita Shviz because a person that returns Shmita products is called Schoyer, it's called business, but because the portion isn't his, so it's he's allowed to according to the, the according to Shmita products, there's no problem to to change with Shmita products. Even though you know that he's going to give you back. So, Bivrit Yesh, Yesh of the Yeshivot, Kola Manot, and Noshechim the Bahurim, and Shaikhim the Rosh Yeshiva. The Bhozot, Alacha Merit, Shumutal, the Tet Mana, Hadashini, Lachif Manot, Hadashini, the Mishrach Manot, I soon I give Mufrash, and the Tenacha Mana, Matamach Ziri, Kize. זה איסוס חוירו, זאת אומרת מפורש, אבל החידוש הוא אפילו שהמנות לא שייכים לבחורים, כיוון שכל אחד מקבל מנה, מותר לו להחליף משלוח מנות אחד עם השני. עכשיו, אם יש לו, ב, אם יש לבחור פירות שביעית, אז אפילו שבדרך כלל אסור להחזיר פירות שביעית לכל הדעות, להחזיר פירות שביעית, כי זה נקרא פירעון חוב לכל הדעות, אבל פה, כיוון שהמנות הם לא שייכים לבחורים, אז אין בזה בעיה להחזיר אחד לשני את המשלוח מנות. יישר כוח.